During those cold days, a heater is one of the first things we turn to. However, it's important to use them safely as we're dealing with the flammable gas here. Let's have a look at a few basics. The hose and bull nose washer need to be checked for cracks and signs of wear and tear and replaced if necessary. These checks should be done every time you replace the cylinder. Oh, and builders can fill and exchange your cylinder for you. After connecting and turning the gas on, check for leaks using a soapy water mix on all the connections, the valve connection as well as the hose clamps. You'll see the bubbles if there's a leak. This should be done outside. This is a gas pressure regulator. Its job is to drop the pressure of your gas line from the bottle so that your home gas appliances are operating on the correct standardized pressure. This is generally 2.8 kPa. This gas heater has three controls. The gas tap on the cylinder, which will be used to turn the gas supply on and off. A gas control knob, which lets you control the heat level. And the piezoelectric ignition button next to the gas control knob. To ignite, simply press the control valve and turn it to stage one. Hold it down and press the piezo igniter. This will generate a spark on the pilot burner, therefore igniting the gas to the panel. Once the first panel is aligned, you can light panels two and three, and the maximum gas consumption on this model is 305 grams per hour. To switch off, simply turn the knob to the off position and turn off the cylinder at the master valve. Ensure that the heater is placed away from curtains and anything that could catch a light and take care with children moving around the house. The front area of the heater gets really hot. It's designed to do that. Be careful. When switched on, never leave it unattended. Now gas is a relatively affordable way to heat your home, but care must be taken when the heater is burning as we don't want any accidents. Now remember, this is just one of the heater options available at Builders, in store or online at builders.co.za. And for more videos like this, check out the blog on the website. Get to Builders, get it done.